from that report by Gishuke. Let's go to Kitui, incumbent Kitui rural member of National Assembly. David Mwalika has threatened to sue independent and electoral boundaries commission IBC for delaying elections that were set to be held on the 9th of August. Mwalika was speaking after casting his vote at Mbitini Ward, that's in Kitui rural constituency, where his opponent, Charles Nyamai, cast his vote at Kenyingi Primary School. Meanwhile, tallying of votes is underway at Seku University, that's in Kitui rural constituency. Here is that report. Six a.m. at Kanyangi Ward, three polling stations were open with voters already queuing to cast their votes. Satisfied with the process, a section of voters expressed their joy in what they termed as a smooth exercise. <laughs> Former member of National Assembly Charles Nyamai, who was vying through a union ticket, to cast his vote at 8 a.m. Also good, uh, the preparations uh, right from uh, when uh, the ballot boxes were opened at um, um, Seco University, uh, Tulling Center, uh, which I witnessed. Uh, up to where we are now, so far, so good. A drama ensued at the Kanyangi ward after a lady who is said to be an agent was allegedly accused of bribing voters. Incumbent member of National Assembly David Mwanika cast his vote at Mbitini ward. He, however, threatened to sue IBC over the, the delayed elections, saying he has incurred losses in the electoral process. <laughs> Unajua siyasa, siyasa ni expensive. Um, kwa hivyo tumeingia garama kubwa sana. Na kitu ya kushangaza ni wakati likutana na, na uyu mwenye kiti. Uh, uyu mwenye kiti, chepkati. Alituomba msamatu. Na akasema kuna kitu uh, inesawanyikana, inesafanyika. Na mimi kama, kama mkombeaji kwa hii kiti, nitaenda kwa otini tenda kotini kudai gharama yangu kwa sababu mimi nimeumia kifedha nimeumia kiroho familia yangu imeumia wafuasi wangu wameumia